Hey guys, my name's Doug with obdgenie.com. Today we're in the late model Dodge Ram. As you can see, it has the RA3 or RA4 8 inch screen. What we're going to demonstrate today is the Chrysler Group backup camera programmer through obdgenie.com. It's the C RVC part number. This Genie here will turn on backup camera in any of the Chrysler Group, uh, which includes Dodge, Jeep, Chrysler and Ram. Um, it'll turn on all of the touchscreen radios, whether it's the big one, uh, the My Gig, the smaller one. It'll turn on backup camera on all of the touchscreen radios that has been out since 2007. So I'm going to demonstrate now exactly what we're doing. So as I mentioned, we're in the Ram truck. We went ahead and installed the backup camera in the back of the vehicle in the tailgate handle, and we ran it into behind the radio using the OEM Auto Parts Co. kit. So what I'm going to do to demonstrate is I'm going to put the vehicle in reverse and show you that this car is not programmed for a backup camera. You'll notice the screen didn't change at all. So now what we're going to do is we're going to plug in the backup camera programmer into the OBD2 port. You'll notice your speedometer cluster or EVIC will reset and you'll also notice a green light on the Genie. That means you can remove it. So now what we're going to want to do is shut the vehicle off for about 30 seconds and open the door. It's now been about 30 seconds so let's start up the vehicle. We're now going to engage the vehicle in reverse and you notice we now have backup camera. I'll now demonstrate how the dynamic grid lines work. I'll now demonstrate this in a MyGig based vehicle. All right, we are now in a MyGig based vehicle, um, particularly a Jeep Wrangler right now. You'll notice the touchscreen radio. Now this touchscreen radio is in a whole lot of cars besides the Wrangler, so as long as you have this style of touchscreen radio, you'll be good to go. From 07 to 17, they have the MyGig based touchscreen radio. Um, you'll notice here, if we put the vehicle in reverse, we do not get a backup camera. The Jeep Wrangler specifically doesn't even allow that from the factory. Well, here at obdgenie.com, we can enable that for you. So in this particular case, we went ahead and installed a backup camera to the radio using the OEM Auto Parts Co. kit. So now we just need to program it to appear when you put it in reverse. So I'm going to go ahead and plug the Genie into the OBD2 port. As soon as the light on the Genie turns green, it's safe to remove. You'll also know your screen will reset. You can now engage the vehicle into reverse. And now we have a backup camera. I'll now demonstrate the same Genie also working in the older REC uh, based vehicles. All right, we're now in the REC based vehicle and you'll notice the REC sales code on the bottom right hand corner of the screen. 
Um, this specific radio here, only 07 and a few of the 08 versions of this radio are backup camera compatible. Uh, we're at, we happen to be in an 07 RAM right now. Um, so we went ahead and in, installed the backup camera to this system. And I'll demonstrate putting in reverse. Nothing changes on the screen. So we're going to run the same programmer into this vehicle to turn on that backup camera image. Once the green light appears on the Genie, as the other vehicles, you can just remove it. You'll notice the um, screen here reset itself. So let's go ahead and engage it into reverse. And now we have a backup camera. Come check us out at obdgenie.com. We offer so many more upgrades for your vehicle. Um, you can also check out oemautopartsco.com for your backup camera kit. Um, thanks for watching, guys.